Good morning, Reefers. I'm Daniel, and these are my 3D printed overflow boxes that I made over the past couple days. And I'm going to show you the improvements between the models. Uh, you know, you get your standard overflow corner box, and it looks something like this, right? So we made this for our frag tanks for the store. Um, I just needed something quick so we could get them plumbed and I could get them to you guys ready. So, um, so check it out. So this just has regular square, right? I didn't like that. It was kind of boring. Corner was square. Boring. So I said, why not make it round, right? If I'm going to print it, I can do any shape I want. So I said, let's give it a little curve. I said, this will be a lot sleeker than the corner, right? And the bulkhead's round. So I said, we'll put some corner to it curve in the corner and then I also took all of these overflow corners and I gave them a really nice rounded edge I don't know if you guys can see that there but a beautiful rounded edge so and then these are cut out for the trim so this gets caulked in the corner and then the lid gets over the top of here so I have a lid to cut down on drain noise and also so things don't climb over and splash or fall in there or whatever but that's the corner overflow box, right? So that was number two. And then I ran out of black, so I had to go to my trusty orange over there. Um, this is all PLA filament, by the way. This is made from like plant plastic. Um, so it's biodegradable and all that good stuff. These are just prototypes. So this was the next one. So I gave myself just a little bit more room, move this in for the trim just a little bit more because if you're gonna caulk in there, there's no reason for me to have it airtight, like with the plastic rubbing. So I was like, you know what? It didn't fit, it was a little too tight. So open these up just a tad more, and I added on some writing. I don't know if you guys can see it there. Um, but it says Coralust, I mean, right there, there you go, um, in the top of the overflow. So I just added that for fun. Um, but I will prep this one up, I think this is good to go. So I will file this down, get away any string lines, and I'm gonna mold this, cast it, and I'm gonna give myself like six of these for the frag tanks. And this thing here, this is actually the plastic that it's gonna be made out of. So very um, durable, very hard plastic. So can't wait to see how these turn out. But there you guys go. Um, I, my next 3D project is gonna be the center overflow for where the returns come out. And then I'm going to do some interesting things because we're using the vector pumps from Ecotech Marine. Uh, we're actually going to try to pulse the returns to see how that works for flow. And it's only a 50 gallon frag tank, so I didn't want to put MP10s in there and do all kinds of crazy since corals will be changing. And it's not really growing in there. Our corals are just for um, selling for you guys at the store. So, so we got the filtration on lock. Now it's just this stuff. Um, so there you guys go. I will test this out later on and show you guys the next update so as always thanks for watching happy reefing until next time have a good night If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend, and thank you for being part of the Coralus community.